Hello everyone, I know that some of us may have seen this video I'm about to show you, but it yet again serves as a reminder that we are living in the end times. And the devil's agenda is being constantly, blatantly, strategically and deliberately pushed right in front of our faces and unfortunately many people are not seeing it. In the video I did earlier titled Indoctrination, I pointed out that children are being indoctrinated through um, the school or educational system, the mass media, and the entertainment industry like the music, videos, movies, cartoons, games. The other day my husband wanted to download a certain game for the children so he had to go through the review first before making the download so he noticed from the review that this children's game had adult themed connotations and it was subtly promoting homosexuality but beyond the school system, the mass media and the entertainment industry Indoctrination is coming from the most unlikely quarters. Watch this video and see what I mean. It is blatant, guys. Like, seriously, just let's just take a look at the video. Right, I've just come to Tesco just to show everyone. I saw it online and I wanted to check for myself. Right, candy kit and sweets. Looks rather innocent. Sweets aimed at the children especially right now i'm actually shaking i'm so angry i'm actually shaking right now so aimed at the children uh, as you know sweets are where children go yeah never take a sweet from strangers never take sweets from people you don't know because we know sweets are the uh money of the predators for the children so now we've got these candy kitten sweets right now look at this Netflix sex education candy kittens wild strawberry sweets right Netflix let this sink in sex education let that sink in let's turn it round let this sink in look at that right sweets but make it gourmet sweets and sex they go hand in hand obviously after all they both aim to make you feel good right so we've teamed up with hit Netflix show, Sex Education, Celebrate uh, Sex, the fun times, the awkward times, and the downright dirty times. No judgment yes, here, just a whole lot of love. This is aimed at children. <laughs> this is aimed at children. So it's okay now for children to pick this up. And by the way, um, it looks like, oh, I didn't see that on there. Uh, there you go, we've got, condoms there you go we've got a condom there right so play it safe we've got a condom this is Tesco's selling this so um, a lady's just overheard me reading this out sorry how old are you if you don't mind me asking uh, 77. 77 do you think this is okay that children should be buying sweets like this not at all no and yet we've got it in our shops being sold sweets for sex when you were young were you told not to take sweets from strangers because it was dangerous because they're predators absolutely yeah. not. I didn't even know what that was right now we have it here sweets and sex they go hand in hand can you understand this where it's going yeah, yeah. I'm gonna to speak to the manager sex children why are you pushing sex to children why the children why are they not letting children be children? Why are they feeding their young minds with adult information? Why are they working so hard to pollute their young minds? I believe that the reason is summarized in what Jonathan Kahn said. When you get the children, you have the culture and you get the future. Be spiritually sensitive. This is an intensely demonic agenda pioneered by the devil himself. A lot of children are confused because of things like this. Many are battling gender crisis, sexual crisis, identity crisis because of things they have been exposed to at a very young age. I want to encourage you according to 1 Peter 5 verse 8. Be alert and of sober mind. Your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion looking for someone to devour. Pray for your children. Protect your children. Teach your children. Train them in the way they should go. Be an intentional parent. 
because our primary assignment as parents is to raise godly children.